In this edition of Growth Points, we will be taking a look at Proverbs chapter 24, verse number 32. I applied my heart to what I observed and learned the lesson from what I saw. Exactly what is the author talking about here, applying my heart to what I observed and learned a lesson from what I saw. This becomes more clearly as we take a look at verse 30 and verse number 31 of Proverbs chapter 24. I went past the field of the sluggard, past the vineyard of the man who lacks judgment. Thorns had come up everywhere. The ground was covered with weeds and the stone wall was in ruins. So what is it that the author observed. He observed someone who was lazy, a, a vineyard uh, where the man lacked judgment. Because he had not taken care of the vineyard, the thorns had come up everywhere. The ground was covered with weeds and the stone wall was in ruin. And what is the lesson that he learned? He learned that we must all guard against being lazy. He learned that Diligence requires more than an initial effort. Being diligent requires us to work and work until we complete that which we have started. You see, it's not enough for us to start a project, but we must finish that project as well. It's not enough just to plant seeds and leave them unattended until the harvest. Because if we do not take care of the watering and, and the weeding, the things that are necessary to maintain that ground and that soil, if we neglect that ground and that soil, there will not be a harvest. And this is true in every vocation, in every endeavor of life. We must be diligent. We must be dependable. If we are not diligent, if we are not dependable, we could lose our jobs. If we are not diligent and dependable, projects will go undone and they will not be completed. If we choose to become lazy, we can lose what we have and we can find ourselves in difficult and hard times, potentially facing poverty. You see, lazy is, laziness is more than not just working at all, it is not exerting the necessary diligence to continue and to complete what we have started. So may we be diligent to complete what we have started. May we put forth the effort and be a good steward of what God has given us. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for the talents, gifts, and abilities that you have given us. Help us to be diligent to complete tasks that we have started to uh, put forth a good effort at our job and not be lazy. Help us to serve you and honor you with excellence. I pray this prayer of blessing over you. May the Lord bless you and protect you. May the Lord smile on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord show you his favor and give you his peace. Because of you, Jesus, and the hope of heaven, we believe and we know that the best is yet to come. Amen.